Nakawa, a resident of Kasoko St. Chireka, says she arrived at Nakawa Division at 7 a.m. in the morning with the hope of returning home with her national identification card. Florence, like many others, have tried to get registered but in vain. She says the exercise has costed her time and money and wants government to consider issuing national identification cards at places of registration. How can you combine the whole, the whole division to one position, to one, to one location? Over thousands and thousands of people gathering here. They have children, they are pregnant. Some of us, we have Arusa, no food, no hotel. Also, we have no money, we have not worked. We are overstayed by the Since morning, I reached here at 7 o'clock. However, the spokesperson of NERA, Michael Mganga, says they have a challenge of human resource which cannot match the overwhelming numbers. Still facing challenges by these big numbers. Uh, we are trying our best, of course. Uh, so if UCC goes by its uh, warning and it's cutting off the uh, unverified SIM registrations by, by in the next two days, that's a UCC's uh, decision. Muganga also attributes the litany of complaints to wrongful entry of personal data. The message that comes back to us that uh, some are rejected, actually many are rejected. So we would appeal to people as they enter their names, as they enter their names, to make sure they enter the correct information. Or if somebody is not able really to do this try whatever transaction for the NIN and the SIM card and all that and the names. You ask somebody who you know can help you. Over 1.5 million additional national identification numbers have been confirmed by NIRA. Here at Nakawa Division, people are still in queues as they try to beat the deadline of UCC, which has only two days to go to switch off the SIM cards. But NIRA says that it won't guarantee a speedy acquisition of NIN numbers to those who have been registered because of the verification period. So this is a process which might not... Remember, we are not dealing with a single registration or maybe a hundred or maybe a hundred. This is dealing with millions, right? So somebody who registers in Karamoja now or in Kisoro, we must get the data in Kororo. So you don't expect this data to come and then you process the NIN and then in the evening it's given. NIRA will also commence the exercise to register pupils. Going to register all school going children between those years, 5 to 15. But as NIRA, this is part of our process to fully register every Ugandan. NIRA will continue with the registration and issuance of national identification card even after the deactivation of SIM cards. Aaron Mukama, NTV.